What's up guys, Orion612 back again with some Destiny content. Uh, there isn't much left <clears throat> of this uh, season of The Chosen. Uh, clearly the Hunters are going to win the Guardian games, but uh, I've just realized I have not touched any of these Engrams the entire season. So, this is just a quick vid to see if I can get God Rule anything. And uh, to basically cash in here. Um, 180s might become meta. Um, the slower firing rate uh, auto rifles might become meta. Maybe we get some god roll armor. I'm not too sure. I'm on my hunter now. So I'm just going to cash in all of these and then kind of go through things at Banshee. And uh, see if I can get uh, some God Roll stuff. Maybe get some extra enhancement cores, or I'm not even sure what drops here um, from these things. So we'll do 20 at a time. Run on over to Banshee's, see what he's got. Hipfire Rangefinder, no, no. I've already got the God roll for the Ekalos. That's not a bad roll, actually. Get the stability to pop that on, get a little bit more. Yeah, and I'd run fluted. No armor, no. Well, I've got the Relentless Whirlwind Fallen Guillotine, but. When I also have Jagged Edge, we would need Swordmaster's Guard here, and it would be a perfect god roll, but I have it already. <clears throat> That's pretty crazy uh, armor piece right there, not bad. I'd say not triple S tier, but it's definitely uh, A tier. Uh, what do we have on this? No. Nothing. Subsistence multi kill clip. No. No. Quick draw shield disorient. That could be good in PvE. Threat detector elemental capacitor with a hundred handling. I'm not a big fan of this weapon. Um, simply because I play on console, but. So, didn't get much there, but we will get a bunch of materials, and uh, I can cash in. I think if I've got a hundred of these engrams, I'd get 400 legendary shards out of it, which ain't so bad. That armor piece, if it was, say, 66 instead of 56, I would have 100% kept that. Um, and again, with the Kalos, uh, I've got uh, like two or three different rolls. Um, with a Grave Robber, uh, Disruption Break, I've got the Dynamic Sway, Demolitionist one, so we'll head back here, cash in another 20, see what we get. Some more gear. Take those cores for the next season. We got a long shadow. I'm still looking for snapshot explosive payload. I thought there would be more weapons that he'd be dropping, but I'll get a dire. Dyers might come back. Another core. Be safe out there, Guardian. There's a love of the fight in you. Ah, Underway. Alright, let's see here. Field prep. No. No. 
No, no, no. Threat detector demolitionist, that's not bad. Need the ranger stability here. That's not a bad roll. Like B, A tier maybe. Threat detector outlaw. Alright. Reload spirits. Woohoo. No. No. Threat detector Vorpal. That's not bad too. Yeah, and I can interchange here between the Seraph rounds and Accurized. Plus it's got a hammer forge. This is the pretty good uh, roll here. But I'm still gonna dismantle it. No armor yet. Oh my god, look at the stats on that one. Cloak, no. Opening shot and osmosis. Ricochet. That's actually not that bad with handling. So I'm going to hold on to that one. Because I want to know what's going on with next seasons. I know the TWAB just came out. And osmosis now <clears throat> works with... Uh, Stasis, so I can have a stasis firing dire promise, but there are no enemies that have uh, stasis shields, so I'm just gonna keep that just because I don't have a dire with osmosis. Plus, it's got opening shot on it, so could be a combo between a, a good PVE and PvP weapon. Um, if I'm running the stasis subclass and I lob a grenade to activate <clears throat> the damage boosting perk on it. Alright, let's cash in another 20 of these guys. Get some cores, alright. Wishbringer. I haven't used that in uh, 99 years. These cores though, they're dropping. I'll take them. We're gonna have a submachine gun. Another 180 hand cannon. A lonesome. Lonesome, you really want like a rapid hit kill clip. Uh, outlaw kill clip. Or full auto kill clip. And definitely with the range master work and uh, fluted or hammer forged. No, no armor yet. Pulse monitor auto loading. Doo doo. Got another dire auto loading swash. No, oh, thank you. Auto loading mulligan. I might have. Yeah, whatever. Rabbit hit rampage. Not bad. Ambitious assassin elemental capacitor. With steady. This is a fantastic submachine gun right here. This is going to be great. For PvE and PvP. Maybe even crossplay PvP. Stats are freaking good on this. Plus, it spawns War Mind Cells, so I'm going to hold on to that one. Snapshots demo, no. Grave Robber demo. Could be good in uh, PvE. Alright. I'm genuinely not a big fan of the Lonesome in uh, PvE as well. Always good to see another hero of the tower. I've got 40 left. I would say. Ah, there we go. We got a truth teller. I've got the God Roll. With the auto loading and concussion, I've got the 
auto loading and blinding and I have the auto loading with proximity and spike grenades but I really really enjoy that uh, grenade launcher it's good combining that with uh, crimson last word and now dead man's tail um, it's another uh, extremely good weapon I'm going to stop at 22 here because I want to lose uh, that dire and that submachine gun. So I'll head back. No armor. Blinding demo field prep. And you could switch to spike. If we had reload here, it'd be pretty good. Um, I can keep that quick launch. I might actually keep this. Mm, that's not bad, actually. So the moment swash, no threat detector, ambitious assassin, no threat detector, opening shot with high cal. And a hundred stability. Pretty cool. Not my thing, though. Snapshots moving target. No. Due to armor. Due to sword. Crappy armor. Crappy armor. More crappy armor. Lead from gold opening shot on a rapid fire. Mm, that's absolute trash. Uh, underdog osmosis extended garbage garbage no no armor so now I gotta cash in 17 more and that'll leave me with the last five false promises it's kind of a fun auto rifle it might become uh, part of the meta next season um, but what type of role because the perks on that aren't that great um, will you want to try and find and will they add new perks to um, the loot pool of weapons but yeah we got a CQC shoddy bunch of enhancement cores again which are great you kind of want to farm those near the uh, end of the season so when <clears throat> following season begins you'll be able to masterwork a bunch of stuff feeding frenzy swashbuckler with the counterbalance not bad the blue perfect was an amazing uh was it a 420 or uh, it's a 360 it's even slower okay so those will not actually become the meta i think it's the 420s or 450 the auto rifles can't remember exactly the rpms but field prep disruption break no <clears throat> That's a not bad piece of armor. Again, if it was 66, I would keep it. <clears throat> Let me surround it. No. No. No armor. Firmly planted outlaw. No. No. Rapid hit on the lens again. Lead from gold, snapshots, accurized, rifled. Not bad roll, but lead from gold is it's kind of useless now. And another doo doo helmet. So we got five more to cash in. I would imagine Zavala and uh, Always good to see another hero Drifter. I probably have a bunch of Engrams. Uh, I can cash in there, so after I'm done this, 
I'm probably going to make another video cashing in everything that I got before the end of the season. And, uh, Come back. is there one more? I can't lose rookies in the that it? Be more like you. And that's it. All right. We'll check the last bits. And then, uh, that'll be it for the bid. Subsistence, unrelenting. Subsistence, I believe, is getting a, a rework, kind of like a, a miniature buff. And uh, unrelenting as well, but the rest, yeah, I'm not a fan of. Twenty recovery, not bad, but the stats are just too low. So not one piece of armor. We got three weapons. Um, and that's basically it for the vid on that end. Uh, leave a like, leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe. I'm trying to grow my channel. I hope you guys are enjoying the content. Uh, I'm going to have a bunch of new stuff coming. And uh, yeah, just stay tuned. And I'll catch you guys in the next vid. See you later.